Oh, hi, everybody. Um, it's your boy, Rick, and uh, we're doing a little something different here today. We're, we're playing some... Fun. Hey, no dog meat. He's, he's a good boy. Anyway, <laughs> he's just standing here looking at his house like, what is this? Anyway, <laughs> if you haven't noticed, uh, we're, we're, we're playing some Fallout 4 today because I saw the Fallout series last week, and uh, holy shit, it was good. So I was like, you know what? We're going to do a little video that goes over um, 10 of my favorite mods for Fallout 4. You now, it's not like, you know, like a, the 10th one is the worst one and first is the bit. No, it's just, it's just a list of 10 mods that I really like in this game. So, yeah. Anyway, um, let's go over some of them mods. Do you ever go through your uh, your perks and be like, man, I wish I could like move some perks that I don't use into other places, cause like, you know, you, you want to change your play styles around a bit, right? Well, I got the mod for you, respec holotape. So um, this is a little this is a little nice little mod that uh adds this little holotape, and uh, you put. The hollow tape into Pit Boy like that. Bing bang the boom Bob's your uncle. And uh <laughs> you can uh switch around your perk points, switch around your special points. So you can use do that to forget it and then move it into someone move another one and you know. Yeah. It's 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 kinda kinda got a bit of a learning curve, but it's not too complicated. It's actually really intuitive. So, uh, yeah, I think, I think this mod is definitely worthy of my top 10 list because it's just a really good mod. Kind of freshens up the game a little bit if you want to change up your play style. If you're, especially, it actually, it'll probably come a lot more in handy if you're low level and you want to switch things around a bit before you get too committed into one of the perks. So, yeah, it makes you like test things out. So, yeah. I very much recommend the uh, Respec Hollow Tape. So, uh, yeah. As with all the mods, I will put the links to them into the description of the video. So, yeah. That's the Respec Hollow Tape. On to the next mod. So, you're like me. You're watching the new Fallout show. And you're like, damn. That, that brother in a steel flag was cool as shit. I wish it was in Fallout 4. Boom! It's in Fallout 4. I know it's a very simple mod, but it as a, as a guy who 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 loves the Brotherhood of Steel, um, I was like, you know what? I gotta have this flag, man. It looks so much better than the default uh, Brotherhood of Steel flag. Oh, hey, look, there's me down there. Uh, yeah, it looks so much more better, more better. Well, I can't word. It looks so much better than the default. And then there's the uh, some of the walls there, and then there's another flag over there. Um, yeah, it's it, it's a great mod. It's a great mod. Nice, nice little mod that, you know, it uh, doesn't do much, but it very much improves the um, aesthetic of, the, of my favorite faction in Fallout. So, yeah. Anyway, here's the flag in Diamond City, flying proudly, and looking. You, hey, 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 hey! What are you doing? You're interrupting my monologue here, you son of a bitch! And there it is, uh, at the Boston Airport. Also flying pretty well. Look at it. Ain't she a party flag? Sup, Liberty Prime? How you doing? You know, after that battle with the Institute, he hasn't really had much to say. I think, I think Bray's bored. He's just walking around. Look at him go. Not a single thought in his head except democracy. God bless him. And here's the view of the Pridwin's Bridge. The bitch downstairs interrupted my monologue. Anyway, yeah, here's the here's the fucking... Um, <laughs> here's the view from the bridge of the Pridwin. A, a nice view of utter... Wasteland bullshit chaos that we will soon rectify because, um, yeah. Look at that. Ain't that look nice? Wrapped up like that. 
What's up, Max? How you doing? Anyway, yeah, I think that's that, that's enough of me talking about this mod. Let's move on to the next one. The next mod on the list that I have put together is the Galactac armor. Um, as you can obviously see, it's very Mandalorian inspired. Um, and I kind of made mine to look kind of like Din Djarin's armor. Um, you can you can customize it pretty well. I'll, I'll show you a little in a bit. Um, but yeah, um, I got a I got a regular ass Brotherhood of Steel uniform underneath of it. And obviously, I decked it out with Brotherhood of Steel emblems on the shoulders, and the Sentinel rank thing on the chest plate looks fucking badass as shit. And uh, yeah, it's nice. So yeah, here's the helmet. We got all this shit. Um, this changes like the this changes like the stats for it. It's stronger. Uh, and then these. These two change like the different color schemes you can have. I'm not gonna go through all of them, but there's 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 a lot. There's a lot of color schemes you can go through. Yeah, you got your fucking colors. You got your decals for the Brotherhood of Steel. You got all that. Your Sentinel rank and all that. Thing about Jibbity Jazz. <laughs> um, I'm not, I'm not gonna go through all these, but yeah, um, yeah. That's it for the next. Um, for, for this mod. Segwaying into the next mod. What's a good, what's a good set of Mandalorian armor without portable high ground? Yep, we have the cross jetpack. I think a lot of you guys probably already know about this mod, but if you don't, um, it's honestly a must have. If, if you don't, if you don't really like run, lugging around power armor like I do, I mean, I, I love power armor. It's cool as shit. But sometimes I just rather not have it. It's kind of cumbersome. I just run around normal armor. And, uh, yeah, I got this, this jetpack here. I'm going to demonstrate by, uh, hey! yeah, portable high ground. Very, very, very convenient. Yeah, it's nice. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, wait hold on. Wait. This is how you can tell you you're not supposed to be up here. <laughs> just fucking standing on nothing. <laughs> I'm floating. When you run with it in third person and you jump, you can see like little jump boosts like pop out of you. Before we move on to the next mod, I'm going to do a little very quick rundown of the customization for the jetpack too. Because you can indeed customize it like the Galactic armor. You got a bunch of palettes to choose from and then a bunch of color schemes to choose from and it, now this is just like reducing fall damage which is just nice. Um, comes very much in handy when you're using this thing because you can break your fucking legs with this shit. <laughs> um, and then there's like all this different fucking paint stuff. Anyway, yeah, that's it. That, that's 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 enough for that mod. So now we're gonna d demonstrate some of the weapons that we have. Um, first mod that we're gonna demonstrate on the poor bastards who run Gunners Plaza is this laser sword, cross laser blades. It's very fun. It just ow. You know what? Can you like, can you like let me swing at you? You know what? Oh, 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 okay. All right, 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 all right. Jesus, fuck. You know what? This is going horribly. This is going horribly. Fuck you. All right. Just, just get, just get bapped. You know what? I should have just did this from the start. Get fucked. <laughs> Um, yeah, there, there's, um... Alright, this fucking... This turret can suck my ass. Not fe not literally, but, 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 but... Another one? There's another one. Ow, why does it hurt so much? Home run with the laser sword. Hell yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna... Ow, I'm gonna, I, I should probably get out of here. These, these guys are kicking my ass. 
Anyway, I'm gonna show you some of the other laser swords. Um, that was a little, uh, 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 uh a little test. Oh shit! Anyway, uh, we're, we're back home in, in, in relative safety. Um, I'm gonna stem myself again. And, uh, yeah, so this is the laser sword. Here's what it looks like in first person. You can block with it. You can slash with it. You can customize it. But that's not all. There's a bunch of other laser swords in this mod. Okay, so you get the Crucible Blade, which is from Doom. It did, for some reason, it's not showing up. Um, you got the laser sword. You got a plasma katana. Plasma throwing knife. And then plasma throwing knife unpowered. Yep. You, you get a bunch of shit in this mod. Uh, but the, the main... I think the main, the main, uh, the main course of this mod is this laser sword. So, yeah. Um, it's nice. Speaking of lasers, um, I want to, I want to show you a little, little mod that, how is he wiping his face through the helmet? Anyway, um, <laughs> I want to, I want to show you another little mod that, um, improves something so the, the default laser rifle is cool and all but i feel like the animations were a bit lacking so um i have this little mod called the laser rifle reanimation mod so let's uh demonstrate that really quick there's the uh the turn on animation and the Turn off animation. Very nice. Very nice. Yep. Yeah. There's it again. And then and the aiming is pretty much the same. But and the shooting. Shooting is pretty much the same too. But I think the main thing that this mod does well is uh, the reload, which is really cool. Ain't that sick? It, I, I just fucking love the. That fucking like. Like, it's so cool. I fucking love it. It was like, it was like, yeah, well, maybe I should use the default laser rifle again. And then, and then yeah, I, I, I did that. So, yeah, it's great. It's cool. Um, anyway, on to the next mod. Anyway, we're back in Gunner's Plaza. Plaza, 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 really? Anyway, um, so... You ever, you ever wanted to blow somebody up with a sniper rifle? Yeah, we got, we got, we got this, we got this sniper rifle here, this dragon rifle. Part of the Russian assault pack. Um, it's, it's got a nice few mods, uh, weapon mods in it, and uh, we're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna delete this man with an explosive dragon rifle because it's funny. Hold up, we're, we're, we're gonna, 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 we're gonna teach these guys a lesson here. Fuck it, jetpack. We have a jetpack, we can use it. <laughs> um what the fuck? Who's sniping me? You? You get sniped, bitch! <laughs> but that's not the only weapon in this mod. As I said, there's more there's more weapons in this mod. Um Oh, you're getting close to me. You're getting close to me. Okay. Um Saga 12 with fire uh, with a uh, dragon's breath. Um cause funny. He's got some range behind it too. Are you are you stabbing me? Are you still really? Get the shit. Just sit the fuck down. Just sit down. Here's the bison. Here it is, right here. Just gonna shoot a little bit, reload it. Yeah, it's nice. It's a nice little SMG. And then we have the Rex. Here's the Rex. Um, see what I do with mine is I put a, uh, I put I put um I put shotgun rounds in it. So it's basically a pistol shotgun. It's kind of funny. And the last one... I had its vertebrate. And the last one is the, uh, the Stetchkin. Yeah, I made mine semi-auto, but you can definitely make it full auto. Let's see. Oh, whoa, whoa! Okay, it's not that fast, but it's still pretty fucking nuts. Anyway, um, yeah. What are those, what are those brothers you still guys doing over there? Interesting. Anyway, um... We're gonna, we're gonna go to the next mod. Um... I'll see you guys in a bit. All right. Well, I think we're just gonna stick around at Gunner's Plaza for the Plaza Plaza. Why do I keep doing that? I think we're gonna stick around for the next few mods, next three. So yeah. Anyway, the first mod is one of my favorites. 
I mean, obviously, they're all my favorites. I'm stupid. This is probably up there in the top three. It is in the top. I'm stupid. Anyway, this is the AKM Complex mod. Um, we're just going to mag dumb this bitch because it's really funny. <laughs> Technically, I made it into an RPK. Here, let me just... Let me just fucking... See? I made it into, like, an RPK. Uh, because... I don't know. I feel like I needed an LMG. Let me just loot these corpses. You know, actually, no. Fuck it. We ain't got time for that. We ain't got time to loot corpses. I go, I go ahead and loot corpses anyway, because I have a, a, a ADHD. Um, hey, you got a missile launcher? Fuck you. <laughs> oh, and it also comes with a toke rev. Here's the, uh, your gun check in the background. That's weird. There's, 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 there's some shit. There's some shit going on over there. I, I don't know if I want to fuck with that. Anyway. Uh, I'm gonna show it up now and uh, mag dump the tech riff. You can spam really quick, but yeah, it's a nice little pistol that comes with the AKM Complex mod. Speaking of pistols, um, for my last little bit, um, now this technically isn't a pistol, but um, it is something that I made into a pistol called the SR2 Varisk. Now this little mod is very nice. Um, it's just it's just a very fun, very fun little pistol. Let's create this motherfucker. Oh, and he exploded in caps. <laughs> oh, this guy's gonna take a bit. Um, ow. Okay. How about we how about we clear the first floor with, with this gun and then go up to the second floor with the other gun? Okay, yeah, that's a good plan. Yeah, this this mod is very fun. It's it's just what the fuck. Now you can make it full auto and give it a bigger magazine, but um, I don't know. I think I think I like it as a pistol. Plus, I think I feel like it does more damage too. Jesus fucking Christ! Jeez, these fucking turrets, man! Ow! These turrets are fucking annoying. Okay, so I'm getting shot at, um, and, uh, now I'm gonna show you the next and final mod of this game, uh, of this little video. Um, I, I, I misspoke when I, I, I misspeak when I'm under pressure. Um, anyway, we're gonna show off the bullpup bozar. I fucking love this rifle. It's so good. It's, it's just, it's just perfect in, like, every way. Right now I have it in, like, sort of, like, a... I kind of have it as like a DMR kind of configuration, but I think I just, I just, I just love it. It's just great. It just, it picks off these gunners. <laughs> oh god, he just fell off the fucking stairs. I also made an LMG version of this gun, but honestly, I think I definitely prefer the. Uh, oh hello, let's let's vats this guy. Straight, actually, no, yeah, let's just let's just vats this guy to death. Wait, what the fuck? Kill him! Kill him! Up, uh, he's in front of the. F you bitch! Off with your head. <laughs> anyway, um, wait, no, he's upstairs. Shit. Luckily, we have the high ground as a portable, um, high ground thing. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna execute this man. <laughs> oh, I am a sadistic bastard. <laughs> But yeah, that's my uh, that's my little list of uh, ten of my favorite Fallout 4 mods. If you guys want me to go over more mods for Fallout 4, I, I I'm I'm up for it. If you guys are up for it, so uh, yeah, I I, I kind of like doing these kind of videos. If you want me to do it again, let me know. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next week with more Bioshock. And then the week after that, hopefully. Me and the boys will get back into Helldivers, too. So, yeah. Bye-bye!